Okay, welcome back. So, um, you have in this problem we have a triangle, and we take like the foot of the. Wait, what? Actually, what is this? <laughs> you take the foot of the altitude, the median, and the ang foot of the angle bisector, and the. You're told that okay. I, pr I probably need my whiteboard for this. Actually, I don't think I can do this with just text. Uh, you're told that it's equilateral, and you want to show ABC is equilateral. Technically, the problem says if and only if, but like, come on, one, one direction's obvious. It's clear. Uh, so, interesting part. Um, you get the medial triangle. We'll call it the medial triangle. Okay. Oh, I still have a bunch of stuff left over from last time, huh? Is my pencil dead? Is that is that the issue? I thought I had a backup. Uh... No, it's not dead. Okay, cool. Um... Not very. All right, cool. Here's a triangle, I guess. Uh, a, B. Okay, so what do so what do we get? One of them's the midpoint. Um, one's the altitude, and one's the foot of the bisector. Okay, so I guess the big thing is the one of these pairs is really nice, which is this one. Like B prime A prime is actually um just like half AC. Always. Like even without the equilateral condition, we we always have this red segment. Um so if it's equilateral, then that tells us that uh C prime, you know, is also like that. So this semicircle should pass through C prime, ergo this should be a right angle. And because this is also an angle bisector, um, I think that gives us, hang on. So like, okay, C C prime is going to be an angle bisector, but it's also like because of the red thing I drew, you get the right angle. So that implies, actually, I think CA just equal to CB now, and this is also a midpoint. Um, more importantly, this angle is also 60 degrees. So um, by the inscribed angle theorem, or whatever you want to call it, uh, this guy is also 30 degrees. So 30. So angle C is 60. And we're done. Yeah! Okay, that, that was actually a lot faster than I thought it was. <laughs> uh, okay, uh, very good. Um... How about the other direction? Oh, come on, man. Um... Okay, uh, nice. Uh, cool. Let me quickly write this up. Am I worried about like any 
edge case where... No, I think once... Acute triangles are always... Yeah, no, it's fine, right? The in... I don't think the inscribed angle part d depends on... Hang on. I'm, like, worried the triangle might be obtuse and, like, A prime might be outside, but I don't think that's an issue. Uh... No, I think it's just fine. Yeah, this is just fine. Um, yeah, I don't think it matters. Okay, yeah, I think we're fine. Uh, okay, one direction is obvious. Okay. Um, okay, I will not be too- I will not be lazy and I will actually draw a diagram. Uh... What's a good diagram to draw? Um... Okay, let's do- let's use these parameters. 220, 320, and 120. And then A prime equals foot ABC, B prime equals midpoint AC, C prime equals. Um, I'm going to draw a picture for which it's isosceles at the C, because I think that's probably the most informative. Um, ABC cycle 0 0.1 cyan blue. prime red and then circumcircle a a prime c red and then c c prime deep cyan Have you done 2006 G10? Um, didn't that problem... Isn't that actually on the IMO? Like, it's not just a shortlist problem, right? It was actually selected. Is my memory? Um, note that A prime unconditionally lies on the circle with diameter AC centered at B prime, meaning A prime B prime equals B prime A equals B prime C. So if A prime B prime C prime was equilateral, then C prime would lie. Wait, shit. I fucked up the picture. <laughs> See if I'm supposed to lie on the circle. Uh... Oh, come on. Um, um, shit. Sorry, let me try that again. Uh, 220, 320, 420. Okay, how, how do you do this? What, what, what do I put for A to make it work? <laughs> Shit, I think I, I think I fucked this up. Uh, 3, 4, 80, 360. Does that work? Yeah, that's better. Um. Y on the circle as well. Okay. 
since the prime was an angle bisector, And then to finish, note that angle C prime B prime A prime equals half angle C prime C B equals angle A C B. Okay, we're done.